to La La Land on CRN Digital Talk. You're listening to the smooth tones of Nimi and Nokia. If you have any questions for Nimi, go ahead and give us a call at 1-800-336-2225. And thanks for being here, Nimi. Thank you for having me, you guys. I really, really do appreciate it. What an interesting name. Nimi Adoki? Yeah, Adokie. Adokie. <laughs> Yes. Where does that originate from? I'm Nigerian. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. You're like a Nigerian princess, oh is what you gosh. are. Oh my gosh, thank you. You're so sweet. <laughs> she is. She has this long, flowy dress and this beautiful, deep voice and oh. this, like, just glow. Thank you. You're just so sweet. <laughs> and, and what was the name of that song that we just came into? It's called Temptation. Temptation. It was my first single, my first song that I've done that I that really touched me, and I'm just I'm just happy happy to share it with you guys. How long did it take you to do that? Um, maybe like 10, 20 minutes to write it and to record it. it took a about closer, Nimi. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so it took like 10, um, 10, 15 minutes to like write it, just to get it down, my words clear, and to record it. It took about maybe three or four hours. Yeah. Great. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that, that sounds like you know what you want to say. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. I love the production in it. The, the, the background music is, is amazing, of thank course, you. with your beautiful voice. Oh, my gosh. Thank yeah. you. And what is thank it you. that you do want to say? Um, well, I'm just going to, for me, there's a lot of music out there that is, like, not really showcasing life, really. They do a lot of, like, the clubbing is cool, but not to hear it every day. Like, I mean, there's other things to talk about in life. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Love, relationships, friends, family. Mm-hmm. Like, it's good to disclose those things out there when it comes to music. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. But there isn't a lot of that going on. <laughs> <laughs> music has pretty much died. <laughs> We're hoping you can bring us more of that. Oh, yes, Absolutely. yes. That's, I'm doing that. I'm doing that really hard. So yeah. where can I find you? Um, well, my music is on myspace.com uh-huh. forward slash Nimi Star. Mm-hmm. But um, if you want to see what I'm doing, you know, I always tell people to follow me on Twitter. That's twitter.com forward slash Nimi Adokie. Oh, yes. okay. <laughs> and, and spell that for anyone that might not know. Nimi Adokie, that's mm-hmm. N as in Nancy, I, M as in Mary, I, A, D, O, K and kite, I, Y, E. Okay. Follow her on Twitter, guys. Yes. <laughs> wow. And you've been acting for um, a relatively uh, good amount of time. Mm-hmm. Um, how did you first start? Well, I started acting when I was in the ninth grade. Mm-hmm. Um, it was I did a play called Willy Wonka in a Chocolate Factory, <laughs> <laughs> and I was Grandma Georgina, and oh, I was nice. like, oh my gosh! Oh, but I was happy, and I found my love there, <laughs> and I've just been strong on acting and it's always been it's a good thing for me that i could express myself through different characters through situations and yeah i love it It makes you happy it does it grounds me you know when you know things in life is messing with you go towards what you love which is acting and music oh so absolutely yeah (laughs) and you spent some time studying at uh the cell adler i did i was there for a year and then i had to leave because i felt like i had enough you know and i want to explore i get i'm a person that likes new things i like to you know be adventurous and explore other you know techniques that's out there so i was there for a year and i took my time and i you know i I enjoyed it and then you spread your wings and and i flew flew. Mm -hmm. (laughs) how long have you been composing music for doing Um, music I found out, first off, I found out that I could sing when I was in the third grade. Uh-huh. My friend, um, I, I don't know if she's even, you know, watching or hearing this, but um, her name is Tiffany Williams. She, <laughs> we were in third grade and we were um, sitting down in the cafeteria and we were talking. And so she was singing and then everybody else around us was singing. And then she said, hey, you know, why don't you go ahead and sing? I was like, sing? I've never done anything like, you know, like that before, you know? So I don't really know what to say or sing to you. But um, I think I sang Spread Your Wings to Prepare to Fly. <laughs> and I sang that song, and then voila. Uh, it was history from there. <laughs> that's great. Sometimes so. that, it's that first memory, that mm. first song that you sing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, I was happy. I was it's like, almost, oh I mean, it's, yeah. it's soulful. Mm-hmm. Very soulful. Oh, well, thank you. Would you say that your music is like spiritually, spiritually related? Mm, yeah, well, growing up, I growing up in a Christian family, mm-hmm. um, and that's all I, you know, listen to, Christian music. You know, the music that they're writing that they have there is beautiful. And you grew up here in Los Angeles? Oh, no, Texas, sorry. Okay. 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 <laughs> Sugarland, Texas. Okay. <laughs> Sugarland, okay. Oh, the sugar. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I, I did... Um, 
I uh, listened to a lot of Christian music down there, and uh, it was soft rock, soulful, you know, some country, you know, I like country too. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> and um, yeah, I just, I loved it. I loved that, and I sticked with that for a while, and then I started going on to the, you know, worldly songs, secular mm-hmm. songs, so yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. <laughs> and um, we, you know, as you know, we get a lot of um, listeners listening in different areas of the country, mm-hmm. thinking about coming out to LA and, mm-hmm. and pursuing their uh, dreams of being in the entertainment industry. Would you give them any advice? If you could oh, talk yes. To them? What would you I say would, to them? I would say make sure you pack a lot of money because <laughs> <laughs> things here are extremely expensive. Um, and while you're pursuing it, don't ever give up. Don't listen to what people say. Just keep on moving. Be your own person. Be your own motivator. Do not let anyone come near you, talk bad about you or anything. You know, Be open to making friends because there are good people out here. And then there are those that are sneaky and snakes. Mm-hmm. You know? But just always be on your guard. Mm-hmm. You know? So, mm-hmm. yeah. Great advice. <laughs> Nice. You. And you're performing out right now? Right now I'm just writing and recording. Okay. Right now I just want to write a few, you know, singles and then I'm And you have performing. your own producer that you like to work mm-hmm. with. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> it's someone in Hollywood. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I've been working with him for a while. He's really good. He did all the, you know, drums and the all the instrumentals for the song. Oh. So I'm really yeah. happy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite thing about being an actor? Oh, my favorite thing is just being able to tap into situations. You know, I am able to just every time for when I get a script or something, I always do the background of something. I create the background of everything and I have to keep reading it over and over. That way it gets into me. And then when I do my scene, I get that natural emotion and that whatever I need to deliver for that, you know, mm-hmm. character. So that's my favorite thing, just being able to tap in to certain things. Yeah. Oh, I love it. And just let it be and mm-hmm. see what happens. And not to be scared, just to let go and just go, you know, because you are going to eventually come out of it. But you know, just being able to explore all that, you know, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. That's one of the hardest lessons for an actor to learn, <laughs> just to let go. You know, I, I, I heard a quote that said the, the best thing for an actor to do is to get out of their own way. Mm-hmm. And it's mm-hmm. true, you mm-hmm. know. Yeah. Yeah. Good, good advice for life in mm-hmm. general. Oh, get yes, out of your, your own, own way. way. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. yeah. you're coming on through. Mm-hmm. So. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You yeah. seem like you're very open to letting go. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. You've always I love been to, a free spirit. Yes. I love to just be the, to walk into the unknown. It's fun. Do not know where you're going, but you know you're going somewhere. Amazing. It's just, it's fulfilling. Mm-hmm. It just gives me this adrenaline rush, you know? Yeah. I'm just like, I don't know where I'm going, but I know I'm okay, and I know God's going to protect me. So I'm just, that's just how I... Yeah, two wow. Well, we know where we're going. We're going to commercial break right now. <laughs> well, thanks so much for coming in and talking Thank to us. Thank you so much for having me, you guys. I appreciate it. Thank oh, you. Mimi Adokye. Oh, my gosh. Bye, guys. Find her on Twitter at Mimi Adokye. Yes. It's um, twitter.com forward slash Mimi Adokye. She just showed me a no, smile on your face. <laughs> for sure. That'll work. <laughs> Thank you again, you guys. Thank you. Thanks, Thank you. We'll be back on La La Land with Brett and Ned on CRN. Digital Digital talk. Talk. Has your growing